Hello YouTube. This is Benchmade55 here. Hope everybody's doing well today. I wanted to uh, show you something that I got. I just celebrated a birthday recently and so um, I got some birthday money and uh, I've always wanted to get one of these and so I uh, purchased one. It's a home weather station and um, it does a lot, has a lot of features. It will uh, tell you the wind direction, it will tell you temperature, humidity, uh, radio control, time, indoor temperature, outdoor temperature, indoor humidity, outdoor humidity, rainfall and a rainfall history, uh, minimum and maximum temperatures, uh, displays the date with a calendar and the weekdays, and it, so it includes a rain gauge and uh, wind speed and time and temperature centigrade or Fahrenheit. Now I was reading because there's a piece right here that you have to take and uh, put up on your roof that collects the uh, the rainwater and then this uh, determines the wind speed and everything. So um, I got a hold of these batteries that I read about. They are um, they're a little pricier but they're supposed to last Ooh, nine times longer, and they are uh, lithium. And so I'm gonna I'm gonna try to uh, see how this works out for me, and because um, I don't want to have to crawl up on the roof to replace the batteries all the time in this unit. So I haven't opened it yet. So let's have a look. One of the reasons that I got this, uh, well, I just enjoy you know watching the weather and doing that, but uh, is because I'm gonna be uh, putting up the wind turbine. And uh, I wanted to see how that's all going to work as far as the, um, as far as wind speeds and all of that stuff. Well, let me look in the viewfinder here. We'll have a look and make sure that you uh, are seeing what I have here. Alright, so it looks like we got a uh, instruction book. Oh, yeah. Lots of settings and lots of stuff to study. And then, uh, this is a, I believe this is the sensor that goes in the house, or in my case, probably in the shop. Pretty nice here. It has all the buttons and, and everything, and, and uh, then I'll put the batteries in there and see how it all works. But I just wanted you to see that. Oh, if something's broken, call this number, and they'll take care of it. <laughs> so, we have this part here. These look like, uh, oh, a bracket. A U-bracket, another U-bracket. And I think that's designed for, uh, here's some zip ties. And then, um, here's the unit that goes uh, up on the, on the roof. Pretty nice packaging on here. So a lot of good reviews on this, and that's why I uh, picked up this particular one. So, um, it has this pole here. That's pretty cool. And so I guess you used a U-bracket. So I think that was for something like if you wanted to put it on a, a fence post or something. So, I don't know if you could see that. Let me get this out of the way here. And all the all the debris. So two U-brackets, some zip ties. This works off of batteries. Oh, pretty handy. Has a little level right there, a little bubble level, because you have to keep it level, because this is the part that collects the, um, the, the rain water. And so you gotta keep it level to determine the right to, right amounts there. So, oh, that's going to be a little bit of a challenge to get that. I'm, I'm seeing that. And then it looks like right here is where the battery goes. So all the electronics are kind of upside down. And this, I guess, picks up the temperature and the, and the uh, humidity. It, it reads it. And then there's two... Uh, Two things here. This vein looks like this probably determines what direction the wind is coming out of. And this here will will pick up the wind speed. It's all plastic, but it's uh it's pretty 
what do you what do you get? It's uh, it doesn't seem like a piece of uh, crap. So I guess it's where all your rainwater collects. I'm not sure if it goes in there and it holds it or how that exactly works, where it still lets the water flow out if that if it comes down on this here. So I'll have to read the directions and uh, see see what that's all about. So I will study up on it a little bit, uh, see how it works, get it mounted up on the roof, and then I will uh, give you an update on what it does. Okay, this is Benchmade 55, uh, over and out. Don't forget to like and subscribe if you uh, enjoy the videos that I'm uh, putting out there for you. And if there's something on the homestead that you're interested in, just let me know. Um, be blessed. Out.